moving on, we have Rajesh now who's dialed in from Mumbai. Rajesh, how can we help you? Yeah, good evening, ma'am. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Uh, ma'am, uh, just uh, I recently got shifted from Patna uh, to Mumbai. So I'm uh, very new about uh, Mumbai and uh, my office is in uh, Orly. Okay. So this, I'm looking for one BHK. My budget is 40 to 45 lakh rupees and uh, both like Thane, uh, Thane, Western Line as well as Central Line, both uh, suits to me. So, uh, what will be the best location where I can find uh, one BHK? Uh, for uh, like, uh, just I, uh, I can uh, in 40 to 45 lakh rupees budget. 40 to 45 lakh rupees budget, one BHK and he works in Worli. He is not a Mumbaiker, which means he is not really used to the local train over here. So we need to give him a location that he can, you know, easily travel to and fro from. Uh, I think, unfortunately, he will have to uh, get accustomed to the local uh, train travel because I think uh, uh, the, the budget that he has, uh, very difficult to find properties where he can travel by road uh, in, in, a, in a fairly reasonably short time. Uh, so, I, so I think his primary mode of transport is going to be uh, a local uh, a train network. And that means that uh, he should find or he should look for properties as close to any of the suburban stations. Uh, now, uh, and, and, and in Mumbai, the closer uh, you go towards stations, the, the property price uh, rises. Uh, given the budget, I think he has he has two choices basically. Uh, if, he, if he prefers to live near a railway station, then unfortunately he has to uh, look for areas which are uh, beyond Mira Road, Bhainder, uh, the, the most likely areas where he will find properties uh, uh, with a walkable distance from station would be Vasai, Nala Sopara, Virar on the western line. Uh, I don't think he will find uh, that kind of property in Thane. Uh, Thane on Ghodbandar Road, away from the station, yes, uh, uh, he will be able to find properties in that budget. But uh, closer to station, then he will have to probably look for areas beyond Thane, uh, if say Kalwa, Diva, uh, uh, Dombivli, Kalyan, where uh, in, in that budget he will uh, find properties near, uh, near to station. There could be some pockets within uh, suburban Mumbai, for example, say uh, Charkop or, or Gorai, uh, where uh, he, he might, be, uh, might get lucky to find uh, properties in that budget, but those areas are away from the station. So he'll, ha he'll have to uh, build in about uh, half an hour's uh, uh, time, uh, every time uh, to and fro from, from the station to his house. Right. And Rajesh, uh, those are the prices that we are showing you on the screen. Vase is currently priced at around 5,188 rupees per square foot. My team will put up uh, the prices for Virar and Kalyan and Dombivli as well, uh, Mira Road also. That's it. Virar at 4,476 rupees per square foot. Uh, Kalyan priced at 5,706 rupees per square foot. Now, uh, one thing you need, uh, one piece of advice that I can give you as a Mumbaikar uh, Rajesh is that uh, if you are, you know, if you have no other option but to take the local train to travel, one thing that you could do is look at buying into places like, for instance, Kalyan or Dombivli where trains actually terminate or start from. That way your travel becomes that much more easier. So that is something you can consider doing uh, if you're planning to buy a flat in the far-flung suburbs. You can watch live TV on our website mbnow.in. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash magic bricks now. And don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at magic bricks now. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash magic bricks now.